fishes for identity on my chest. Tucked under a mixed family, it dangles like a worm on a hook under American waters. David, you've become a constellation we no longer strain to see. Like a king's crown, your yellow light showed us through the darkest times, exposed us to the darkest crimes, when you labeled us a problem, a question. They answered with genocide, another problem, another question. They answered with atomic bombs, more problems, we stopped asking, and instead promise never again. We lie, dead, as our babies boom. Might as well drop them out of the planes. It makes as much sense as cartoons, as war propaganda. Dear David, they gave you a nation, but what did you say? Are you trapped between those two blue bars, or can you still get away? Because Israel was dropped on top of Palestine and is there to stay. Like one triangle turned around and dropped on another. You see, David, my brother, cannot be anti-Semitic if he is as Semitic as me. Isaac Ishmael just wants to be free, but you've got him building pyramids out of the charred dust of bulldozed homes in the Gaza, stripped of rights. You've let your brother sleep naked and hungry too many nights. You, you pharaoh, cashing checks from the West Bank, you become settled in your thinking. Unlike your Torah, you do not move. You have not turned. You, you six-sided sinner. You, you blind Goliath. You have a hexagon center that points nowhere but inward. What are you looking for out in that desert? Is it another ghetto? Are you somehow jealous of the swastika's popularity among disaffected youth? I mean, mm -hmm. are you trying to be a badass? Or are you just an abused <laughs> child, now grown up and molesting your nephew and calling him names. Dear David, our homeland is neither our home nor our land. Just like the Christian right is neither right or very Christian. Mm. And you, my symmetrical friend, represent me no longer. You are a problem, a question. You answer with violence, repression. More problems, more questions. Your jagged corners do not know how to answer. How ashamed you've made us. I used to cover all my notebooks with little pictures of you. Now I tuck you under my shirt in order to hide my association with, my role in unwillingly supporting your racial, national, religious apartheid. You make me sick, David. Oceans away, you fish for identity on my chest, reminding me who I am because of how you can't be, reminding me where I come from by showing us where we can't go. You are a fallen star, not lucky nor bright. Yet I still see myself in you far too often like some birthright trip to hypocrisy from Crofton, Maryland, because all I can say is never again as I tuck my necklace away and pray that we end this oppression. <laughs>